Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to my garage. So here we are, a couple days before the 210-day update, and just like last month, I'm going to drop this video uh, to kind of update you and let you know where we stand and how everything's going along here. Uh, we're done pulling from the grid. Uh, the 210-day update numbers are going to be a little lower than they normally should be um, because... I took some of the stuff and put it back on grid. We were out of town for a couple weeks, uh, and the weather had been so cruddy. Uh, I, I just didn't want to deal with it. Uh, so I put some of the stuff back on the grid, and then I moved the outside lights over to this system. Uh, so the numbers are going to be off for next month. Uh, just be advised if you're going to watch the next video in a couple days. Uh, it's going to be messed up. Uh, but everything's back the way it's supposed to be now, and in hindsight, I should have just left everything because we had more than enough sun while I was gone. Um, we have full systems right now. As a matter of fact, uh, I'm trying to figure out how to burn as much as I can on this one here. Uh, we're throttling at the moment because the sun's shining bright out there. Uh, and it's only taking in 10 amps and we're using a little over 9 or somewhere around 9 right now. Uh, let's have a quick look at this. So while we were gone, the load was on this one and it is now at 71.7 I don't know what it was the last time but I know it went up a few uh, because the load was on this terminal for two weeks and the solar array has made 574 kilowatts now as you can see the load is no longer this this is no longer hooked up here I moved it back over to this one uh, and we'll go through this one here real quick PV arrays made 81 kilowatts and the load is currently at 30.1. Uh, yeah, this one's getting throttled too, as you can see. Um, it's full. They're both full. I could have left everything alone while I was going on vacation, and I didn't. I I became a nervous Nelly because I wasn't sure. And yeah, it cost me a little bit. But hey, I guess better safe than sorry. So as it stands, we are no longer pulling grid power. Uh, we shouldn't need it from here on out. As a matter of fact, uh, the sun is out. Um, a lot more often now and and for a longer period so we make more than enough the the part where you're you're trying to eke out uh, every last one uh, just so you can not use the grid power uh, that's over uh, now we got from here all the way through the end of the summer uh, into the fall when the leaves change we've got power to spare uh, coming up at some point soon I'd like to get a 300 amp hour battery for this system here uh, lithium ion one uh, with a 200 amp BMS that, that'd be awesome uh, hey if you want if you are a battery manufacturer and happen to be watching this and you want your company's name stuck right here in all my videos hey send me a battery uh, 300 amp hour with a 200 amp BMS uh, I'll start running some tests and compare it to these four flooded lead acid batteries uh, and, and we'll put it through its paces over the course of the summer here um, if you got one and you want to send it to me, my email is um, listed here on YouTube. Shouldn't be too hard to get a hold of me. Anyway, back to way to uh, the way things are as it stands now. Um, I think I used a total of. Hang on a second here. Let's see here. So summer totals on the grid, or I'm sorry, winter totals pulled from the grid. Oh, let's see, 16, 1163, 86, 120. So we pulled about 1,400 amp hours total for the LifePo system uh, on the off the grid during the winter time when we just weren't getting enough. We weren't getting enough sun output. Uh, just too many cloudy days in a row. Really hurt. I've never had to pull that much. As a matter of fact, um, I, I, I'm quite sure I probably won't have to do it again. It was unreasonably cloudy there for a while. Uh, and as far as the um, flooded lead acid system goes, I'm going to say right around 450 amp hours is all we put into that. So one full charge out of this one, uh, basically, maybe a little bit more. Um, that system doesn't have much of a demand, so it, it doesn't require a whole lot of upkeep. But uh, I'll put the notebook away because I'm quite certain I'm done um, adding from the grid. We, we should have more than enough power uh, from here all the way through the summer. So that's it for now. Um, come back in a couple days and we'll, we'll give you the math and the numbers and and uh, we'll have everything so you know exactly where you stand on the 210-day update. Hey, 
Have a good day, everybody, and a better tomorrow.